There we go. Volume is working again. Jeez. I guess the bright side is that I have my units again. Farron, I need this help. Yaru to what third they say. I'm your worker. The first has that well at the door. Yet to be ready for Hestus. That is yeah. Oh that shit! Swap as wise shit in there. We have yet break! Okay, so it's back right before I decided to do the stupid thing of fucking. Uh, I guess it's a town siren with all the heroes technology. Okay, I managed to hold them off, so that's nice. Um, let's get this gold real fast. <laughs> Do you just need to hold them up? Nah, so basically what I need to do is wipe out the rest of these guys right here. It's just I need a big ass army. <laughs> Cause uh, yeah, I, I thought I had enough to deal with them before, but uh, that turned out to be not true. So now I'm kind of trying to assemble enough units to the to uh, deal with all these guys. Okay, so I'm gonna do all that. I'll get that going. This is almost done, so that I can actually make the archers way better. What day did be on done? Safe to Hester's. Delphende is mean leaf. Okay, have them Every do that. Every charm and ten death. Delphine to do. Uh, 
See they to worker. It he'll go and drop the wood. One needeth be undone. Charles Waker. Echo Brook. Arita, what needeth worker? It can't be down. There's more workers here See for some worker. reason. Okay, let's have them put down no trees no here. See they to worker. Wooder, what needeth be undone? Turn folk already ready. And I'm doing that. Two folk already ready. Uh, let's have another mill. Just, just make another one right there. Okay. Uh, Pestes Comus. Outstanding, spare men. I don't even have any enforcement. That's a better question, actually. Build a fence along the river, lure them in, and ambush them. Well, here's the thing. I have to go to them. They don't, they're not going to come to me. That's the problem. <laughs> Have them in a wedge. These guys are going to be three. Uh. Oh, I just made a fucking pyramid. Okay, <laughs> hey, I just need some horsemen now. Send a horse, they won't chase them. Nah, they'll, they'll come back just like right to here. That's why I'm kind of like super prepping, even though I probably don't need to. I'm also just like, this is my first time playing Age of Empires anyways, so I kind of also don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So I'm like, trying to like, just compensate for that with just numbers. Where's that trader post? Oh, I guess I don't have it in this one. Just gonna make that real fast. Actually, where's my king? Obesius is on a there. Uh, where's my trading post? So that's what I freaking need right now. Crap. It's 1 a.m. I need to sleep. Have a good night and good luck. All right, man. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> well, we'll see how it goes here in a moment. <laughs>
I think I'm about to have enough units to deal with this. Just chance it. Let us read it, Cletus. A great as for a moment, get us busy. No, Tulkes, set it down. Look at your beauty ready, Frekis. It is Sita for actors. Okay, let's let's just go. Before we ought await it, let us go. What needeth be undone? Be off yard to Hestus. Sway our Sarah Uta to folk. Arthur Canitas, all is with from home but rallied by their king the english army forced a french surrender and put king louis and his knights to flight with the impromptu battle ending in resounding victory for the english king henry had secured his ancestral lands under the english crown oh hey at least i got that going <laughs> oh gosh Let's drop something. But, uh, it's four o'clock, so, uh, probably call it quits for a little, or at least now. Well, right, we're gonna finish this up, at least with the cutscene play. After England defeated the French at the Battle of Brimule, Normandy was back in King Henry's hands. But one year later, his good fortune 
turn to tragedy. In 1120, his son and heir, William Adeline, died in a shipwreck. The future of Henry I's kingdom was in jeopardy. Henry desperately needed a new heir. With no legitimate sons left alive, he broke with tradition and chose his daughter, Matilda. Henry forced his barons <coughs> to swear an oath to accept Matilda as queen. But when the king died, they broke their promise. England would not be ruled by a woman. Matilda's cousin Stephen saw his chance and claimed the throne. The crisis moved to the capital. At Westminster Abbey, Stephen was crowned king, but Matilda wanted what was hers. She was also lining up powerful supporters who would fight Stephen for her right to rule. Their conflict engulfed England in civil war. Fighting raged throughout the land. In 1141, everything focused on one of the kingdom's most strategic cities, Lincoln. Matilda's allies had commandeered the castle. But King Stephen was determined to take it back. He besieged the castle. Stalemate. As dawn broke on February the 2nd, everything was about to change. Matilda's half-brother, Robert of Gloucester, raced to break the siege. As Robert's forces approached Lincoln, Stephen's army turned away from the castle to face them. Robert could win Matilda the crown, but only if his army could win the day. All right, well. As much as I want to do this and keep playing, I do need to eat. probably pick this back up in the morning if my like computer doesn't go nuts all right just put me in there and I'll Restart this tomorrow. Robert of Gloucester's forces approached Lincoln. Their task to liberate the castle from King Stephen's siege. While behind Lincoln's walls, troops loyal to Matilda held the castle for the Empress. First, Robert's forces would stage an ambush to prevent enemy reinforcements from joining with King Stephen's army. I gotta call it here. Uh, we'll just, yeah, we'll just save it like that. And quit. 